Deserts are one of the main sources of sand and dust. These are far from being homogenous and include both mineral and organic elements. In a closer look, sand and dust come in a variety of shapes, sizes and chemical composition. The finest dust particles can be transported over long distances from the sources by the winds. Saharan dust, for instance, arrives frequently to southern Europe, but it can cross the continent and reach UK and Scandinavia or move westernly to the Caribbean. The main deserts are found in the Dust Belt, in the North Hemisphere. But there are many other active sources of dust around the world. And, in fact, dust transport is a global phenomenon. High levels of mineral dust in the air have many unwanted impacts in many socio-economic sectors. Increases cardiovascular and respiratory diseases and infections. Interferes the solar irradiance and dirties solar panels, reducing its efficiency. Air traffic and flight safety can be compromised. But moderate levels of dust can be beneficial sometimes. The iron in mineral dust is a fertilizer of oceans and crops. Interdisciplinary research teams are improving observations and developing cutting-edge modeling research to create a new generation of dust services for society.